school topper. Who loves me the most? Who loves me the most? Wow, that's almost as impressive as Balder taming a dragon. Climb on up, if you are still coming. Whoa, are these all Aesir gods? What? You think all Aesir are gods? But Skilder told me that oh, only... Oh, well, if Skilder told you, clearly whoever that is must be the authority on Aesir gods, not the Aesir god you are currently talking to. You literally know nothing of our culture, do you? I know lots of things. I know a giant built that wall. A giant built the wall that keeps out the giants. Primther, son of Thalmor. I know the whole story. Really? I truly cannot wait for you to regale me with the revisionist tales of Asgard's architectural history. Is that Odin's palace? Palace. Do you think the Allfather needs to puff himself up like some mortal chieftain? I guess not. That is the Great Lodge, which the Allfather built with his own hands. I'm sorry if that is a letdown for you. Real power, you see, does not need to flaunt. It emerges when the time is right. Don't you agree? Ah! Hey! Whoa! Ah hey! Helmets! I brought you a practice dummy. I thought we were going to own it. You see, the thing is, you do have treasures in tent. So I am not letting you anywhere near the altar. something take one more step you're not gonna like how this ends really and how do you intend to stop me 
Look into my eyes. You tell me. You are a sick man. Loki, you made it. I am so honored. I, I see you've met Heimdall. He reads minds for me. The boy is false, our father. This young man, who is my guest, is covered in mud. Care to explain? He means to betray you. <gasps> is that true, Loki? You a little trickster? Uh, I'm just messing around. Of course he means to betray me, huh? Heimdall, why else would he come? I've given him no reason to trust me. Not yet. But he's got some very big questions. And I have so many answers to give. What are you up to? Dismissed. Go. Gladly. And you, clean yourself up. Oh, oh, my God. Heimdall, will you just relax? Were you intending on killing me first thing? See? What, that's not good enough for you? Get out of here. <laughs> He's a lot, I know. Very perceptive, but sometimes he just forgets to think. You know? Hey, I got some places to go. Walk with me. So how'd your father take the news that you decided to accept my invitation? I don't think we should talk about my father. Not well, huh? <laughs> Can't blame him. Between my ex-wife and my disgruntled former employee, he's not exactly getting an unbiased view. But you, you're curious, open-minded. That's important. Priest, meest, carry on. Pretend I'm not here. If I'm being honest with you, Loki, you're lucky my offer still stands after you went and sprung tear. But I suppose spending time with him is punishment enough, isn't it? <laughs> At least Mamir never lost his sense of humor. But look, it, that's all behind us now. I like to keep looking forward. Hey, hey, hey! I want them trained, not decapitated. Just keep it below the neck, all right? Is that really what you do when I'm not here? All Father. Queen Gana. The Ain Huyar are ready for your blessings. Okay. That's why I'm here, isn't it? Huh. Guess there's a new Valkyrie Queen. Great soldiers, these Ain Huyar. But they tend to come out of Valhalla a little foggy. I do what I can for them, help them remember who they were in life. Important, don't you think? A sense of identity gives things meaning. Moon the Nafen Rothgar. Moon the Nafen Warm. Moon the Nafen Yana. Okay, next up. Ah, the books, good. Those are for him. I understand you're an avid reader. These are just a few things from my personal collection.
Uh, thanks. Jürgen, those better not be mushrooms I smell. Listen, I appreciate your offer, but I'm really not sure what you're expecting from me. Right now, you're just visiting, Loki. One step at a time. Steady there, Carl. But with all respect, you need to know. I came to study, not to serve. Another servant is the last thing I need. I need someone with drive, with curiosity. Someone will take initiative. That looks good. Is that braised? But why me? Is it because I'm half giant? Big deal. So's Thor. Erlen, try to stay awake for me. Okay, but... Look, don't overthink it. I have a project I think you'll be interested in. A major learning opportunity for both of us. What about my family, my friends? I need to know nobody's gonna get hurt. Why would I hurt anybody? A truce is all I've been asking for from the start, if you recall. Look, you're here now. Stop worrying. It's all gonna be fine. Almost to your room. My room? Yep, just over here. Feel free to come and go. Take what you need, poke around as you please. You're not my prisoner. And more importantly, I am not your father. All father, there's a situation that needs your attention. Sif, you missed welcoming our new house guest. Say hello to Loki. This is him? Here. In our home. How nice. My diplomat. Everything all right in New Midgard? The refugees are fine. The situation is with the dwarves. You know who is back. Yeah, it's always something. Put those books down. We got another stop to make. Uh, sure. Yeah. All right. I'm here. Where is he? He? Oh, he, uh, just over there, All Father. Sir. <gasps> uh. Chief, it's been too long. What's the issue now? No issue at all if you're trying to build volatile death traps. I approve these designs personally, and not all that recently, I might add. Did you just wake up with the urge to be a pain in my ass? Yeah. Who's the cut? You training puck pockets? You know what, Berlin? You reek of cheap mead, and that is by far your most endearing characteristic. Now listen up. It's me, your entire economy, speaking. I want you to know that I have confidence in you. Confidence you can deliver me these machines as promised, on time, on budget, and, of course, safely. The dwarves have never let me down, and they're not about to start now. Right? Good. You're a crutch. Okay, son, I'm gonna let you catch your breath. When you're ready to get to work and start getting those answers, meet me in my study down the hall. Oh, and help yourself to a change of clothes. Guess I could try this on. It has less mud on it anyway. Nice! Whoa, I can use this. Huh. 
Nicely equipped. What needs work? Whoa! Loki, right? Gotta say, the irony of this isn't lost on me. This was his room, you know? His? My brother's. Your brother? Modi? Ah, oh, your brother. Really? I had no idea. Uh-huh. And now it's yours. Enjoy. Fruit throws, Doctor. Relax. You've got some pretty small shoes to fill. We're better off without him, Loki. Trust me. Walk with me. Uh, don't forget your sword. Uh, someone will clean that up. So, uh, what kind of sword is that? It's new. One of a kind. My father gave it to me for Valkyrie training. You're in Valkyrie training? Got time to talk about it? I was just heading to the Great Hall. But if you need to go to work, grandfather's study is just down those stairs. So how do you become a Valkyrie? First, I train till I'm the best I can be. Then I wait till grandfather notices. And then I hope he and my dad can convince mom it's okay. You know, my father and I, we encountered a whole bunch of Valkyries. Wait, what? Where? Promise to tell me everything. I promise. Mother, did you meet Loki? Oh, now he's got you involved with this? Involved with what? I'm being friendly. Isn't that diplomacy? You understand who this is, right? What his father did? Why does he want him here? Mom! You're embarrassing me. We'll talk about this later. Discussing this in a year show. Idiot. I, I, I must have done something wrong. I don't, I'll get her again. Sorry about her. Moms, right? So, did you want to look around some more, or do you really need to get to work? Shut up and drink. But something's different work with the Please do not involve me in your pathetic attempts to impress one another. Huh? Come on. You haven't had enough Heimdall in your day? Let's go. Listen, whatever grandfather is having you do, remember, this is your chance to prove yourself. That's all that some of us want. Oh, yeah. I'll try to do some good.
Catch you later. Yes, I, I understand. Yes. Do you see me nodding and saying, yes, I understand? I... I... Uh-huh. Yes. Yes, all right. Mm-hmm. You see, this is you not letting me talk. No, Hugan, I, I don't need my ears clean. I need you to stop croaking and, and, and accept the answer you know I'm about to give. I was just looking at this. I don't think. I've had that since... Who can remember? <laughs> you, you have a name? Ingrid. Really? Sure, why not? Take it, if you like it that much. For real? Consider it a perk of the job. Thank you. I mean, really. And they say I'm the bad guy. Come on, let's walk. Everyone's got me all wrong. You think war drives me or power, wealth? Nah, never have. You know what drives me? What I really want? I want answers. Same as you. See, mortals have it easy. When they push up against life's big questions, they can look to us. They give them meaning, divine comfort. <laughs> we both know that's a sham. But when we have questions, why are we here? To give meaning to mortals while living without it ourselves? No. I'm more than that. And I found something that proves it. What is it? It's what drives me. You feel it, don't you? Feels like knowledge. Truth. All truth. All the answers. We could find out why we're here, learn how to change our fates, stop Ragnarok for good, maybe? Save the people we love. How? I was a young god when I found it. Spent lifetimes studying it, following every clue down every dead end, looking for and finally unearthing this. You see that? It shares the same mystical energy. It opened a crack. Can we just look inside? I wouldn't recommend that. What's the broken mask for? You recognize any writing on it? These aren't from the Nine Realms. From smoldered earth and obsidian spark and a field of battles never fought. Are you certain? Because if that's a clue, I know what it means. And what's that? Keep working with me and find out. You don't have to kill anyone. You don't have to betray your father or yourself. Come on, I know you felt what I felt. The answers are in there, let's get them. I mean, you translated this language like it was nothing. If I do help you, what's next? Thor, get down here. All father. Don't do that. 
What's next is chasing this down. Take this. And this stealthy side of beef. And see where it takes you. I don't promise anything. Nonsense. Happy hunting. And you. Go easy on him, you hear me? Spohan, the rest of the mask is here. Tomorrow, our father dropped us. What do you think? Take that and do your damn job. So, where are we going? How the fuck am I supposed to know? All father thinks that you know what you're doing, so do it. Weird. Well, it seems like we go through this rock. Who's gonna get that? <laughs> With those arms? Hacking. Up there. It looks like there might be a ledge we could reach. If we... Too slow. Hey! <laughs> you can't just grab people like that. No, what else are they gonna do? Throw you? <laughs> the day's young. <laughs> Moving on. Do what I What do you mean? Later. 
Don't want to keep the Allfather waiting. Speaking of which, mask. Right. We need to head through those rocks. Hey, can you? Yeah, that. Just imagine what it can do to bone. You want to talk about blood payment? What about the giants you killed? They were my family. Thalmor, Ronair, they were your people too. The giants were blights on the Nine Realms and I reveled. Every single one of their deaths. Let's just change the subject. Y you know, uh, last time Father and I were here, we beat every one of Surtur's trials. Think you could... Don't play. Modi had some problems, but he was my son. And the only reason you aren't mush right now is because of that broken piece of wood. Look! Clearly neither of us can do this mission alone. And I want to impress the Allfather just as much as you do. You don't have to like me, but we're gonna have to trust each other. Just a little bit. Trust. mask is, uh, pulling this way. We'll have to find some way down. Sure thing. I wasn't playing you, by the way. The trials are fun. Don't you ever have fun? They're so different from your daughter. She seemed... Hey, come look at this. Thor, what the... Surtur's shrine. You didn't die over there, did you? No, but I was thinking... Well, that's your problem. <sighs> the trials are just past that cliff. Might be something you would do to you. First, we deal with them. Come on, Thor. Just check them out. What have you got to lose? Time. Uh. 
That's right. Just try it. You getting tired? Not in the slightest. <laughs> An ogre! Are you worried? Not in the slightest. Do or I go! The Allfather's waited hundreds of winters. He can wait a little more. It's fun. Fine. Stay right here. Yes, sir. That should keep him busy for a while. Hopefully. Come on! In the now to get to that shrine. Hey, Ingrid. Do you trust the ace here? I mean, I know I can't trust them. I just need them to trust me. But that's only gonna happen if they think I trust them. Yeah. My father and I visited this place the last time we were in Muspahan. Feels like forever ago. Where's the shrine? Uh. 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 Can't you guys go fight Thor or something? Boda? <laughs> you know, for someone who 
Lucas trained as a warrior, you are tragically easy to startle. I, I... I didn't. What are you doing here? A girl can't visit a shrine of her own volition? You're here for Sorter's marble. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> You're out looking for more giant marbles? You know what this looks like, right? Like the life story of one of our people? And also maybe a storage closet. No. This looks an awful lot like Defying Destiny. The question is, what are you doing here? Rewriting my story. Odin gave that to you? It's not. Well, he did, but it's not. I'm not working with him. I would never tell him anything about Ironwood if that's what you're worried about. And I'm definitely not serving him. Prophecy's words, not mine. I've got a marble to find. You're welcome to help if you want. Fun. Are you sure you're up for breaking the rules like this? There aren't any prophecies of you collecting any marbles. Our endings haven't been written, right? Come on. Shane. <laughs> Hello there. A sentient sword. Huh. Another marble. Surters. No soul in it, though. So he's still out there somewhere. A while back, you talked about how the giants left. You ever think about them? All the time. They're far from here. Far from Odin and Thor. But I wonder what lands they've gone to. What seas they've crossed. What? I want to find them. I'm going to save my father, and then I'll find them. It's starting. Who is that? Not Surtur, that's for sure. Look at all that frost. Sinmara. Hmm. Don't think I've heard of her before. And here comes Surtur. Wow. This must have been some fight. Yeah, until it wasn't. They just stopped? Oh, no, no, no. Look. It's because they fought together. Looks like they even became friends. Uh, good friends. Are they? Yeah, I think they are. Oh, well that's good for them. But it looks like their um, love caused them to combine into some kind of huge creature. Ragnarok. And then... Ragnarok destroys Asgard. Right. I saw that in Groa's Shrine. Well, that was... something. Oh, hey, remember the snake we put that soul in? Can't really forget that. I saw it. It's getting... bigger. Like, faster than normal bigger. Yeah, I had a feeling that would happen. Huh. I'm gonna hang back here. Don't want your, uh, friend to see a giant he missed. Of course. Just... Be careful. Please. You too, Loki. Hey, Ingrid. Think Thor died from... You thought you could defeat the god of thunder? Oh. Down like the lava ran red with their blood. 
true, Will. Great! You wanna help down here? Wouldn't think you'd need my help if you beat all those trials. Or did you just watch your father do it? Hey, what's taking so long? Things I just killed, it was great. I think you're right. Rude would He'd be faring better than you at least. Help down here? Wouldn't think you'd need my help if you beat all those trials. Or did you just watch your father? Hey, what's taking so long? Things I just killed, it was glorious. I think you're right. Fruit would love it. She'd be faring better than you, at least. that at any time you seem to be handling yourself well enough i was trusting you so where to let me check looks like we need to head through that gate thor make that impressive real 
god stuff. You are a god. You're damn right. And so am I. It's here. This is the spot. Well, where is it? In the lava? I don't know. No! No! Ah! Damn it! Some advice. Sticking your hand in lava is never gonna feel good. I wasn't thinking. Good. It's better that way. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, Loki, don't try to play me again. You're an okay kid, but you're still a giant and I'll revel in killing you too. What did you do? Loki, <laughs> the rift got brighter. Look, you did it. Look, one of these phrases is complete now. We can read it all. But you can't translate it. Not yet. See, I got a little theory. I think if we can find the rest of this, we can use it to look into that without, you know, losing an eye or worse. Look at this. We make a good team. Don't we? Don't we? Make a good damn team. Just like you and Balder. You both behave out there? Thor was really great. I learned a lot from him. You learned something from him. Really, now? <laughs> okay. What did you teach the kid? Nothing. What could I possibly teach him? Exactly. Ah, <gasps> I was wondering where that went. Actually, I had a pretty good idea. Change of heart. I'm not really sure why I came to Asgard, but I realize now it wasn't to be a spy. I need you to know you can trust me. And if I'm gonna help you take this to the end, I need to be able to trust you. And trust is earned. I get it. Take this, figure out the rest of it. If you're staying, that is. You're gonna tell me what you're really looking for in there. Translate that. And I'll tell you everything. And on that, young man, you can trust me. You always this hard on Thor? Seems like you're mad at him or something. Ooh, getting nosy. Getting personal. No, I get it. But it's nothing like that. It's... Well, to be honest, it's the only language he understands. I'm serious. Go ahead and try being nice to him. See where that gets you. So, about the sword. Is Ingrid the name of the soul inside it? I wonder why I can't hear her. Soul? Who said anything about... Look, son, some free advice. You don't want to let anyone catch you talking to your sword. All right? It's a bad look. How much time does he spend reading? Kinda jealous.
Hey, you're back. How was it? Did Father behave himself? Yeah, I mean, better than I would have expected, I guess. Is that the sword from Grandfather's study? Oh yeah, her name's Ingrid. <laughs> Hi, Ingrid. Wow, all Father must really trust you. Well, glad you survived your first day. Hey, me too. Tomorrow we talk about Valkyries. Definitely. Did you think that I would be? Well, I mean, it's a pretty good sword. I'm not angry. I'm concerned. You know that's not what I want for her. You don't want her to have a sword. No, it's not about having a sword. It's about what you use it for. I think you know what I mean. Yeah, I do. And I don't want that for her either, okay? You don't have to worry. She's a smart girl, smarter than her father. <laughs> well, <laughs> when you're right, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, come here. Well. This has been a weird day. Exactly. Good morning, brother. No news, I'm afraid. I have a plan. Do you now? The Nords. You found them once. Could you do so again? I could try, but I don't see how that they would help. They are the fates of these lands, are they not? I would know what they know. You may not find them cooperative. As long as I find them, where do we search? Midgard. But if Atreus is in Asgard, there's no getting him back without an army. We should be raising one. Yes, nothing like a catastrophic war to improve the situation. The boy seems quite capable, perhaps if you simply give him some time. You are not free of blame here. You encouraged his foolishness. Confusion. I do not seek war. But if Odin has stolen my son, do not doubt the lengths I will go to. Your nature has always been clear, Kratos. But you, Freya. War is a first resort. That's not the Freya I knew. I hope the Norns can give you the counsel you need. Perhaps mine is no longer of use here. 
Tear, stop. This is no time to divide ourselves further. Come, sit, please. You have been quiet. Frankly, I'm surprised you of all people would seek out fate. But your instincts haven't let us down so far. Let's find the norms. Who am I to offer him counsel? I only hoped to help the boy find his answers. And I failed. What's my role in all this now? Tyr, you're at the center of this. You always have been. That's why Odin imprisoned you in the first place. He's terrified of you. I doubt that very much. It's the truth. And not just because of prophecies. No one has ever united the realms as you once did. That is not who I am anymore. I know you feel that way now. I've lost myself before. More than once. But believe me, there is something beyond that. And what is that? Purpose. Purpose is the path that leads you to yourself. So you would have me accept my fate. Lead your armies into war. Secure your vengeance. If securing our justice is not your purpose, then find another for your own sake. this? Only when I worry. How would a trace get to Asgard? I'm sorry, but you'd have to ask Odin. He's got control of every path. I know how highly you esteem our expertise on such things, so I'm sure that's disappointing. He's just been one step ahead of us. something for you. Sindri! Coming! Before you go traipsing off into the dawn, I thought you'd like to have this back. Hmm. Well, don't go getting too cheery about it. But you're welcome. I've collected what we need to find the Norns. Shall we go? Madame Nito? Madam Neethog, where have you been? Neethog? I suspect we may have consequences to look forward to. They're sweating bricks on Main Street, and y'all gonna go in his time right now? Dig. Oh. Oh. 
squirrel. Ah, Master Kratos, my apologies. Madame Nethog's disappearance weighs heavily on my mind. She a friend of yours? Less a friend than another long-time tenant of the tree. She was here even before I arrived, and that was ages ago. To even think something could keep her away from her babies. Terrible, just terrible. He's coming. What do you need to talk to him for, anyway? certain the trace could not still be in Midgard. I was just there and found no trace. If Odin invited him, he must have provided a way. No, that is not the only explanation. Tell me where we find these Norns. I discovered some of their threads near the frozen lake. I stashed one for spellcrafting, but we may also use it to find them. Just remember, they really don't want to be found. Well, at least things will be difficult for a change. We should take your sled and head to the lake. Midgard, how I've missed the freezing gusts and constant radar attacks. Well, that's because they believe Kratos is responsible for Fimble Winter and that killing him will end it. Where would they get an idea like that? From me, of course. Of course. Come. Quiet. She is a friend. Now. Better they get this from you. Once the wolves have the scent of the Norns, we'll just need to follow their lead. I will open the gate. Stop whining. Their fur is matted. When did you last brush them? They are wolves. And matted fur leads to disease. Take care of them and they'll take care of you. Brother, what exactly do you intend to ask the Norns? How I may find my son. Nothing more. I don't imagine it's a chance to clear up all this mess about prophecy. Perhaps get a second opinion on your alleged demise. You didn't tell me you had a death prophecy? When Atreus and I reached Jotunheim, we found a hidden mural. The giants, Fay herself, had foreseen our entire journey long ago. Who we would meet, who we would fight, all of it, as it happened. But you aren't dead. That image was from a time yet to come. I see. You've never struck me as someone who fears death. That's not the problem, is it? No. Death can have me when it earns me. Then maybe it's not the future that bothers you. Faye sent you on your journey, and she made sure you'd see that image at the end of it. And you're still not sure why. I wish to speak of this no further. Now that we are on the lake, how will we find the Norns? Watch the wolves closely. See how their heads point the way? Well, the Lake of Nine has certainly seen better days. The raiders have made themselves quite at home. Not sure I've been back to these parts since our great battle with Seekran. She speaks highly of that fight as well. You know of that. She told me all about it when she found me. She believed you could be an ally. Long before I believed it. The Valkyrie Queen. An ally. I'm the Valkyrie Queen. 
As Sigrun was stubbornly determined to remind me. I should have guessed it was Sigrun helping you recover yourself. She's so loyal. Why? Never. Oh. Mm-hmm. Doesn't take a love goddess to see where you're coming from. I just hope the norms are somewhere indoors. I'm warm. Safe to say, no, I have not missed Midgard and Fimblewinter. Thank you. <laughs> we will see soon enough. Incoming fire! the ominous broken gravestone. The hilt of a sword. Brother, I know that sword hilt. Tread carefully. You of all people know how weapons can carry ghosts. If it does not help us find the Norns, it can wait. Let's keep looking. This way. I feel a trace of their illusions here. I can try to dispel it. There's no time to wander off, brother. Freya's found something. Oh, no. There's nothing here. A false trail. I'm afraid so. We'll have to see what else the wolves can find. Typical Nornish mischief. They know we're searching. I warned you they wouldn't make it easy. And what's the hilt of a cursed king have to do with any of it? Distraction? Coincidence? Who knows? I suppose they'd say we were fated to find it. <clears throat> Thread of fate we are tracing. It's not somebody's life, if that's what you mean. The Norns use it to mark their way when they're outside of the well. All that thought, I think it's about to get violent. More Draugr crawling out of the bloody ground. Fire, 
Kratos. The well of Earth, their home is hard to explain. It's in no fixed place. Entrances come and go. A place wholly under their influence, where the intangible becomes tangible. Like being inside your own mind. But if we go in together, are we in each other's mind? Not so sure I like the sound of that. Mamiya. Have you encountered these norms? Not personally. He is right. They have ways of discouraging visitation. Odin made his share of efforts. Wouldn't talk about what he found. Either he gave up, or he wanted to forget what he saw. Freya, you mind telling us what you experienced when you sought the norms last time? To be honest, the details are hazy. Like waking up from a dream. Mainly, I remember that nothing could be done to change my son's fate, which only made me more determined to try. Brother, what of your story? You faced the fates of your homeland, Let's yeah? Let's see. I feel something. In this direction. Feel what, exactly? Another illusion. It's coming from this wall. The Norns are hiding something. <laughs> Kratos, I feel the Norns over here. Are you ready? Oh, nah. <laughs> Nothing. Another dead end. A trap. Go! <laughs> This search will only get more dangerous. Then we keep looking. Back to the wolves, then. The wolves have picked up another trail. Keep following their heads. Now, brother, what about when you face the fates of Greece? The legends I heard about the ghost of Sparta were surely exaggerated. Exaggerated? Oh, not in the brazen bloodshed righteous fury part. The part where it said you travelled back in time itself to win a battle once lost. 
It strains credulity, obviously. I mean, a rumor about Thor knocking the world serpent back in history from Ragnarok is one thing. It is the truth. The threats of fate span all life and time. The sisters of fate abused their power. When I challenged them, they threatened to undo my existence. So I killed them and turned their power on Zeus. That's the most dangerous and irresponsible thing I've ever heard. These Norns have no such magic. Nor does anyone in these realms that I've ever seen. Ah, can you imagine? If existed, Odin would have it. And if Odin had it, we'd be five shades more fucked than we are already. I would not ask them to change the past, even if they could. I only want information. And that's quite dangerous enough, in my experience. We need to work our way up. This way. Kratos, tell me more of your homeland. It was violent and cruel. Sounds no different from these lands. It was warmer. <laughs> there. Can you cut a way through the ice? Oh, are the norms making magical mm -hmm. ice walls now? No. I think the water just froze. Friends. I didn't tell them to be here. Fire from above! <laughs> 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 You know, I would have beaten you. What? Earlier. If Atreus hadn't been there. Hmm. Perhaps. We could go again. Find out for certain. I would rather not. I'll bet you wouldn't.
I didn't tell them to be here. Norns did to trick all these raiders into guarding them. Not that they have any idea that's what they're doing. The sooner we find your son, the sooner you'll be able to focus. I just hope it works. Just the same. Thank you. A fine sentiment, but right on a bloody note when we're out of the cold, brother. Brother! This way seems like a way out, not a way in. I concur. The Norns are further up. The Huh! 
stronger this time. Over here. This way. <laughs> Opna! We found it. Ah! Isn't it always the third place you look? <sighs> Is everyone hearing that creepy whisper? It is like an itch. In the mind. It means we've stepped into their domain. Be ready for anything. Illusions. Projections, possibly. But assume nothing. There's no telling what manner of creature they've made on Wooden Girls. Delightful!
Are we in our own minds yet? He certainly seems real enough. I hate to tell you, the parts in your mind will be real too. No! <laughs> Seems he was guarding that way outside. Hostile memory at that. These fates should know I will not be deterred. Brother, I had a thought. What if we took a stealthy approach to our next battle? No. Oh! 
Well, certainly clinks like genuine hack silver. I suppose there's one small consolation to this ordeal. At least we won't have to introduce ourselves. Don't credit your reputation, Mamir. Hmm. They see the whole lives of any who approach them. What is that? Keep on it! 
Your shield, brother. Use it, yeah? That's frost in my neck, stop. Another gift of Fimble Winter, I suppose. The magic draining out of all of us has to end up somewhere. This way. The Norns are somewhere in that cave just ahead. that itchy sound again. Normally I don't mind ladies whispering in my ear, but this is positively awesome. Anyone ever tell you that you babble when you're terrified? Terrified? I'll have you know I'm at the very most deeply apprehensive. And breaking tension with humor is the sacred duty of a traveling companion. Hey, how very dare you? Babbling. Door. 
Oh, that looks official. Listen to me, please. Stop! Why did you bring him here? You are not welcome here! Wait! Baldur, come back! Talk to me! I am so sick of your constant mess! <laughs> What you did to me? Something's winking. Imagine them thinking I had any desire to be back on this itchy carcass. Mimi! Sigrun? Brother, hold off! Why did you never turn on Odin? But I did! I tried to stop him any way I could! Don't lie to me! You served Odin from the day you met him to the day we put you in that tree! You sought favor. You wanted his war. You watched him mistreat. Everything. 